I hope that the two of you find some common ground and some common support in there with each other because you went through that together, yes. you survived it together, you're surviving as adults together. You wrote that book and you said that it worked for you and it, it saved your life. You, you had an absolute and unfettered right to write that book. No question. Um, you have an absolute and unfettered right to write another one and another one after that. And you can't control what she does or she does or anybody else does, but the good news is the only person you need to control is you. That's the conclusion I've come to. So you, you go on with your life. I choose to just pretend Jory doesn't exist. She, she's dead to me. I, yeah. There's no one left to forgive. She's not even a distant memory. I've just erased her. That's, that's a fiction. She does exist. Not in my world. Yes, she does. And, and listen, it is becoming to you as a father, as a man, as an individual to say, I, I choose to forgive you and, and wish you well. And that's the thing, his children adore me. No, my children want and nothing I, to do with you really, anymore because of what you did to me. Guess okay. who spent all day with okay. me two days ago? Okay. Your children. Okay. Stop, stop, <laughs> stop, stop, stay stop, away from that. stop, 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 stop. Now you know why I talk fast. Stop, stop, stop. <laughs> no, we agreed you were going to be quiet. I'm going to be quiet. <laughs>